Good morning this Thursday the 14th of March. I'm Sophia Mavridis, a market analyst with Bell Direct. Well, US markets closed mixed overnight with the Dow Jones closing slightly higher, just 0.1% in the green, while the S&P 500 closed 0.2% lower and the Nasdaq down 0.5% as the information technology sector slipped 1.1% with Nvidia, Meta and Apple shares or lower. Now, the U.S. Consumer Price Index, a broad measure of goods and services costs, increased 0.4% for the month and 3.2% from a year ago. Now, the monthly measure was in line with expectations, while the 12-month reading was slightly higher. European markets ended higher following what was a mixed trading session as investors considered the latest US inflation data as well as UK gross domestic product. UK GDP increased 0.2% in line with forecasts. As for what to watch locally today, well, the Australian share market is set to open higher this morning with the SPY futures suggesting a rise of 0.28%. And in commodities, the price of oil is up 2.7% to 79 US dollars per barrel after US data saw an unexpected decrease in crude stocks. Gold has advanced 0.8% after losing more than 1% in the previous session amid US inflation data being released. And iron ore is also in the green, trading at 111 US dollars per tonne. So keep watch of iron ore miners today. And some companies that are set to go ex-dividend today include Breville Group, that's BRG, our auto retailer Eagers Automotive, APE, Ingham's Group, that's ING, and Telco TPG, Telcom, that's TPG. And to end on some trading ideas for your consideration today, well, Bell Potter maintains a speculative buy rating on Lion Town Resources, LTR, after the mining company announced that it has executed a 550 million dollar senior uh, secured syndicated debt facility funding its Kathleen Valley Lithium project to first production. Now the Kathleen Valley project remains highly strategic in its, uh, in its stage of development, long mine life and location. And Bell Potter recognized the higher level of risk with their uh, speculative risk rating as it's an uh, asset development company. So they've lifted their value from $1.60 to $1.90 per share and at LTA, LTR's current share price of $1.39 this implies 36% share price growth in a year. And Trading Central have identified a bullish signal in Resimac Group, that's RMC, indicating that the stock price may rise from the close of $0.98 cents to the range of $1.24 to $1.30 over 26 days, according to the standard principles of technical analysis. And that's all for this morning. Well, I'm Sophia Mavridis with Bell Direct. I hope you have a great day and as always, happy investing.